black history they don't want you to know. Inventor Frederick McKinley Jones Frederick McKinley Jones was born in Covington, Kentucky, near Cincinnati, Ohio, on May 17, 1893. He served in France in World War I. After he returned home, he worked as a garage mechanic, and with his experience, he developed a self-starting gasoline motor. In 1935, he invented the first automatic refrigeration system for long-haul trucks and railroad cars. This system eliminated the risk of food spoilage during long-distance shipping trips and was later adapted to a variety of other common carriers, including ships and railway cars. His patent was issued in 1949. Jones' pioneering designs for mobile refrigeration units led to the formation of the Thermo King Corporation in Minneapolis in 1935 and revolutionized the field of transport refrigeration for trucks, rail cars, and ships. His invention radically altered American consumers' eating habits. Now, people could eat fresh produce across the United States during the middle of summer or winter. Frederick Jones also developed an air conditioning unit for military field hospitals and a refrigerator for military field kitchens. Jones was one of the most prolific black inventors ever. In the late 1920s, Jones designed a series of devices for the developing movie industry, which adapted silent movie projectors to use talking movie stock. He also developed an apparatus for the movie box office that delivers tickets and returns change to customers. He also invented a snowmobile. Frederick Jones was granted more than 40 patents in the field of refrigeration. Frederick Jones patented more than 60 inventions, but is best known for inventing a practical automatic refrigeration system for long haul trucks. Frederick McKinley Jones died on February 21st, 1961. Black history, they don't want you to know.